tenth person has now died in a suspected human smuggling case in San Antonio. The victims were all found in a sweltering tractor trailer early Sunday morning. One survivor told investigator that people took turns breathing through a hole. The truck driver has now been charged with illegally transporting immigrants, which resulted in 10 deaths. That charge could get him the death penalty. CBS's Don Champion is in San Antonio, where the driver is about to face a federal judge. James Bradley Jr., the alleged driver of a truck that became a death trap, arrived at federal court this morning. Officials say as many as 100 people may have been crammed into the sweltering trailer as they rode without water to a Walmart parking lot in San Antonio. Some took off before authorities arrived, but 10 people died, and about 30 were sent to the hospital with extreme dehydration. This happens more than you can realize because people are desperate to flee other countries and come to this country. Some of the victims are believed to have entered the country illegally from Guatemala and Mexico and then got into the trailer somewhere in Texas. I just can't imagine them being stuck in there and dying when they thought they were going to come here for a better life. The truck was registered to pile transportation in Iowa. The company has not yet commented on the deadly incident. Don Champion, CBS News, Dallas. Don, thanks, and we invite you to stay with CBS 11 and CBS News for continuing coverage of this unfolding story. You can always find the very latest information on our website, cbsdfw.com.